What's up everyone, it's Simon and I've got another unboxing that will hopefully finish getting this rigged up perfectly for how I like. All right, there we go. So, as you can tell by my unfinished last video, I did not quite get the FX6 rigged how I wanted. This is very loud. Um, and so needless to say, I needed to try and find some bits and bobs, and I think I got it. But also, I ordered a couple more uh, rye coat things to play around with different rigging of the uh, custom microphone mount. Uh, that's another video. But anyways, what I ended up doing is, if you look closely here, I have an inch and a half long little rod that screws through the end of it that is from Wooden Camera. And I really like it, but it is not tall enough for me to get my camera where I, oh yeah, I forgot. This is actually uh, SAE, not metric. So, long story short, this little inch and a half rod did not do what I needed. So, the thing that made the most sense was the three inch rod that is from the same company, wooden camera, and hopefully this will still do what I want it to do. So one of my worries is that I don't want anything sitting higher than this point up here because this is the, basically like the threshold of what fits in my backpack and this is going to be a uh, little bit of a tight squeeze. So hopefully this works how I think it will. Oh, that's a lot taller than I was thinking. But hopefully it's not too tall. But anyways, so now, we can there we go do this and have the oh yeah there we go that's the ticket so now I have the FX6 monitor tucked in behind the battery um, so that way it makes it super easy. Let me grab a battery. So basically now this whole thing is nice and neatly tucked in. So I have gold mount battery with the viewfinder with my camera settings tucked in behind it. Uh, this is going to be perfect for what I want. Um, we're gonna there. So, as you can see, this is like a nice tightly packed in rig. And so basically my goal is to be able to have this just drop into my Shimoda X70 and then be able to uh, have that come right back out. So I'm pretty stoked and it's really easy. I just have to take the microphone off, take the monitor off, take the battery off, and then this whole thing can go in. And I honestly don't have to take the battery off. So that worked out quite a bit better than I expected, and I'm pretty stoked on it. So yeah, the uh, little thread through and rod mounts. Uh, this works really well if I need to be lighter and tighter, where I'm gonna use BPU batteries instead of golds. But for the gold mount setup, this gets the monitor up and above the pivot point for the batteries as needed. And then I can drop that down in so it's tucked in real nice. And then I can, if I'm operating off of a backpack strap or an easy rig, just kind of hold the back of the camera and go from there. That's all I got for this one. I'm gonna do another thorough deep dive on the entire rig shortly. Be sure you're subscribed for that one. That's all I got for this one. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment down below. Have a great week. See you guys next time.